class 4 IMO level 2. Mathematics question number 21. How many of the following figures do not have any line of symmetry? This has a line of symmetry. This has a line of symmetry. Even this has a line of symmetry. But the only figure that doesn't have the line of symmetry is the second one. Mathematics question number 22. By how much is 19 by 20 greater than 7 by 20? 19 by 20 minus 7 by 20 is equal to 12 by 20. So, if we add 12 by 20 to 7 by 20, we will get 19 by 20. Mathematics question number 23. Shiva mixed 5 liters of litchi juice and 3 liters of guava juice and poured the mixture equally into 25 glasses. How many quantities of juice does each glass has? First, we have to find the total quantity of juice Shivam has, which is equal to 8000 ml. He poured 8000 ml into 25 glasses, which is equal to 320 ml in each glass. Mathematics question number 24. How many cuboids are required to make the given figures? On the first layer, there are 4 cuboids. And on the second layer, the first one, there are 5 cuboids. And on the second one, there are also 5 cuboids. So, the total cuboids needed to make this figure is equal to 14. Mathematics question number 25. The given figure is made up of an equilateral triangle and a square. If the perimeter of the given figure is 40 cm, then find CD. Let each side be A. The given perimeter of the figure, which is equal to the sides AB plus BC plus CD plus DE plus EA is equal to 40 cm. That is That can shortly be written as... 5a which is equal to 40. Using this we can find the value of a which is equal to 8 centimeter. So then the value of cd that is a aside is equal to 8 centimeter. Mathematics question number 26. 6000 newspapers were delivered to 43 boys to various areas. How many newspapers were left if each boy delivered equal number of newspapers? Number of newspapers delivered is equal to 6000. Number of boys is equal to 43. Since the, each boys delivered equal number of newspapers, if we divide 6000 by 43, the remaining will be the number of newspapers that were not delivered. If we divide this, we will get the remainder as 23. So, 23 newspapers were left. Mathematics question number 27. How many beads should be added to tens place in the given abacus if it has to represent a number which is 3 tenths more than the given number shown in the abacus. The number shown in the abacus is 5542. We know that 3 tenths is equal to 30 ones. 3 tenths more than 5542 5, 5, is equal to 5572. So we have to add 3 beads to tenths place to get 5572. Mathematics question number 28. A salesman sold a bike at 1,15,000. When rounded off to the nearest thousand, what could be the possible value of the bike? Rounding off, we will get the possible value of the bike as 1,15,225. Mathematics question number 29. A contractor got contract for the construction of two roads. The length of the first road is 82 kilometers 500 meters and that of the second road is 75 kilometers 250 meters. Find the total length of the road that needs to construct. First, length of first road is equal to 82 kilometers 500 meter. Length of second road is equal to 75 kilometers 250 meters. Length of the first and second road is equal to 157 kilometers, 750 meters. Mathematics question number 30. A movie started at 4 p.m. and finished at 7.15 p.m. If the duration of the interval break in the movie was 20 minutes, then the actual duration of the movie was. First, let's find the duration of the movie with the break, which is equal to 3 hours 15 minutes. If we subtract the interval that was 20 minutes from the total duration, we can know the actual duration of the movie, which is equal to 2 hours 55 minutes. Now we're going to look at Achiever section. Achiever section question number 31. The given bar graph shows the number of cars sold by a company from March to August. I. In which of the following months the sales were more than the previous month? 2. Find the difference between the total sales of cars in month of April and May together and the sales of cars in August. First one, we can observe from the graph that 
May month has more sales. Second one, the total sales of cars in the month of April and May is equal to 35,000. Total sales of cars in August is equal to 10,000. So, the difference between the total cars sold in the month of April and May together and the total cars sold in August is equal to 25,000. That is the A options. Achieve section question number 32. If P plus Q plus R is equal to 13 by 15, P plus Q is equal to 7 by 10 and P minus R is equal to 1 by 30, then find the value of Q plus R. And guys, if you want to know more about fractions and decimals, you can check out our other video about fractions and decimals. I'll link it in the description below and make sure to check it out. Now back to the question. Given P plus Q plus R is equal to 13 by 15, that is equation 1. P plus Q is equal to 7 by 10, which is equal to equation 2. P minus R is equal to 1 by 30, that is equation 3. Substituting the value of equation 2 in equation 1, we can get the value of R, that is 5 by 30. Using this, we can substitute the value of R in equation 3 and we can get P, that is equal to 6 by 30. Substituting R and Q in equation 1, we get the value of Q which is equal to 15 by 30. So, Q plus R is equal to 2 by 3. Achieve section question number 33. Which of the following figures has the least perimeter? Perimeter of figure A is equal to 32 centimeter. B is equal to 40. C is equal to 36. D is equal to 36. The least perimeter is equal to A. Achieve section question number 34. Which of the following statements is incorrect? A. 40,000 plus 20 tenths plus 91 is, e 91 is equal to 40,290. This is true. B. In Roman numerals, symbol X cannot be subtracted from L. Yes, this is wrong. Even though we know that this is wrong, let's just, just check out C and D options just to make sure we are not missing anything. C. The sum of third multiple of 8 and fifth multiple of 5 is 49. Yes. This is also true. D. 8 is a factor of both 32 and 56. Yes, this is also true. So, the incorrect option is B. Achieve section question number 35. At 9.15 a.m., Amit left his house and reached the market at 10.20 a.m. After shopping, he left the market at 11.50 a.m. He reached back at his house at 12.30 p.m. I. How much time did he spend at the market? 2. How much time did he take to travel from his house to the market. Time he spent at the market is equal to 1020 minus 1150 which is equal to 1 hour 30 minutes. Time he took to travel from his house from the market is equal to 40 minutes. That is the B option. That's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe. Hit that like button and turn on post notifications so that you guys never saw on a video that I upload. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.